A new China-US flashpoint has emerged after President Joe Biden said in an interview to a TV channel that the US would defend Taiwan in case of what he called an unprecedented attack by the People's Liberation Army. POTUS's comments have been viewed as diluting Washington's decades-old policy of strategic ambiguity on Taiwan. Biden's comment also flies in the face of Chinese President Xi Jinping's stated dream of unifying the breakaway Republic of Taiwan with the mainland. After Taiwan expressed gratitude to Biden for his promise of security, the Chinese Ministry of Foreign Affairs said the statement seriously violates the One China principle and sends wrong signals to separatist forces in Taiwan. We urge the U.S. to fully understand the extremely important and highly sensitive nature of the Taiwan issue, abide by the One China principle and the three joint communiques, honestly follow through the commitment made by U.S. leadership not to support Taiwan independence, handle Taiwan-related issues prudently and properly, and not to send any wrong signals to the separatist forces of Taiwan independence so as to avoid further damage to China-U.S. relations and peace and stability in the Taiwan Strait. After U.S. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi's visit to Taipei in August that raised a storm, there's been a series of U.S. delegation visits to Taiwan earlier this month, including a state governor and a group of U.S. lawmakers. This despite China demanding an end to U.S.-Taiwan diplomatic contacts.